Just a minute, please. Hey, come on. What is it? Do I... Do I know you? You just woke me up, you know. It's like... Two in the morning. Is something wrong? Again, do I know you? Wait... You look kind of familiar. Are you that guy that sits at the back of my class? Oh. Well, hello. Is there something I can help you with? Like, maybe answering the question you must have for the reason why you're at my house so late at night? Well, hello. Are you gonna talk to me? No, I'm not going to let you in my house. What's wrong with you? You're just acting kind of strange. I think I'm going to go now. Bye. Take your foot away from my door. Hey, I'm not messing around here. If you're here for a reason, you might as well tell me. Stop dicking around. What is it? You know you don't scare me. Is this another one of those fucking jokes? Oh, great, you got me. You woke me up at two in the morning for fucking bullshit drama. You really think I want to listen to this all day? You're just like the fucking rest of them. You wouldn't be the first person to knock in my door at 2 a.m. That's why I'm saying it. If it's not you, if, if it's not them that sent you here, then why are you here? Aren't you gonna tell me? You want to talk to me? <sighs> Fine, come on in. You look somewhat trustworthy, and if you aren't with them, then. I won't judge a book by its cover. I'll give you the benefit of a doubt. But if you put hands on me, I swear to God. I have tasers, you know. I won't hesitate. What? Don't laugh at me. I'm not cute. Shut up. Just come in. You can sit anywhere. So... Did the council send you? The pupil council? It makes sense. I've been ditching for the past few days. Why? Uh, well... I just... I'm a bit of a... I'm a bit of a shut-in. Yeah, I, um... I don't really like being around people, and they just drain my energy really quickly. Sometimes, college is just too difficult for me. <sighs> Tell me about it. I thought after I went to college, it would kind of be over. It wouldn't be like high school anymore, you know? But it kind of just is the same. They still make us wear these uniforms. Oh, <laughs> I'm a bit lazy. <laughs> I normally, I'm quite a night person, so I sleep mainly all day. Get up and clean and then put on my uniform and go back to bed for a few hours and then I had to work, school, you know. It's just easier, you know? It's comfier for some reason as well. Huh? Can I get you tea or anything? Oh, okay. Not a problem. Here's some water if you want some. Well, it's a common courtesy to offer a beverage for someone that comes into your home, even if it is two in the morning. Quiet down, come on, I have neighbors. It's okay, just don't 
shout too much. <laughs> so, if... Oh, yeah, I didn't let you answer. Did the council send you? No. Oh. You were worried about me. <laughs> Why? Why on earth would you be worried about me? <sighs> you really shouldn't. Oh, come on. This neighborhood isn't that bad. <sighs> kind of sound like an old friend I used to know. Oh, don't open up your door to strangers at night, especially inviting them into your house. Uh, what can I say? Mm. I stopped caring a long time ago what happens to me. Don't even know why I'm telling you this, but... I just... I want to change, and change never really came, so... I kind of became quite dull as a person. Started caring less if anything bad happened to me, and... Look where we are now. So... Oh, sorry. And uh, it's nothing. I just someone keeps texting me is all. Normally I should get grouped out by that type of thing, especially when they're threatening my life, but I just I don't I don't really know. For as long as I could remember, I just started to... Everything is just kind of black and white. Dull blues and yellow. My favorite color. Don't you just love the color yellow? <laughs> is it just a me thing? Uh, probably. People judge where I live now because it's such a run-down neighborhood, but... That... Is beautiful to me. The rundown buildings and just the yellow hue from everyone around and the street lights. Well, when they're not run out. <sighs> I'll be safe. As I said, I have a taser over there. And I know some karate, so I'm really good at protecting myself. Mm hmm. You don't need to worry about me. I'll be fine. Seriously. Is that all that you came here for? See if I was alive? <laughs> well, I'm fine. Seriously. You can go now if you want. I do have some things I need to get back to. <laughs> Five more minutes then. So... Um, what's your name? Probably should have asked that by now, but I'm not actually quite sure. I'm sorry. I don't mean to be, uh, rude or anything. <laughs> it's just, you know. Oh, well, it's nice to meet you. Well, officially. I've been bullied for a long time at that place. <sighs> I take it you've noticed then. I mean, you just sit like about three desks behind me, I suppose? By the window. Yeah, I remember. I'm not- I wasn't lying when I said I remembered you. I do. I just don't really talk much anymore. Yeah, they've been doing it for a long time. I knew them from, I knew them from high school, <sighs> apparently because I matured a little quicker than them, they couldn't really handle that, so it was just kind of abuse from there, and even now, they still don't quit. Yeah, I tried to sand it out, but I couldn't get those things off my desk, so... I guess I just have to put up with it. <laughs> I mean, what am I supposed to do? It's not like the teachers really care. They never have. 
So I just deal with it. It's a part of life. Yeah, I know. Those type of people really do drain you. But as I said, there really isn't anything I can do about it. I kind of just deal. Eventually I'll get out of here, I know that. <laughs> I'm sorry. You're really easy to talk to, weirdly enough. I suppose it's also because I don't really have a filter when I start talking, but I haven't really spoken to anyone in days. <laughs> Weird, right? <laughs> Oh, okay. It's uh, nice to meet you, though. So, um, are you sure there's nothing I can get you? Or are you ready to head now? Yeah, you can ask me anything. I'm pretty much an open book. How do I feel about you? Oh, I don't really know you, but <laughs> you seem pretty chill, other than a little bit creepy. No, no, I don't see that as a bad thing. It's just you showed up at my house at 2 a.m. It's a bit strange. Oh, you're like me then. You're an overthinker. No, honestly, I get it. <laughs> I overthink all the time myself. I can't help it. It can be like the dumbest thing, but I do it all the time. Hey, maybe we could be like friends and get along, you know? I mean, if you wanted to. I don't really have any, so that sounds really, really sad to say out loud. I'm, I'm sorry. Um, just if you wanted to, it'd be kind of cool, you know? Yeah. So, um, I should probably let you go. I, I'm fine, though. I'm safe. I'm good. And I should be in college tomorrow if you wanted to meet or hang out or something. Uh huh. Sure. That's not a problem. I can show you the way out if you want. Uh, sure, not a problem. Come with me. Oh, shit, this, uh, this door always jams like this. I'm sorry. What are you doing? 